Hey YouTube, Garage Boys back out again. On today's episode, I'm gonna show you how to remove the alternator on a 2001 Kia Sportage. This will work between the 1998 to 2002 Kia Sportage. Our alternator is right back there. I'm gonna remove this car first and then go from there. So here we go. All right guys, first step is we're gonna remove this uh, air intake right here. Uh, you're gonna have two bolts, they're size 10 millimeter so I'm missing this one but it's gonna be a 10 this is what I'm using right here I'm gonna remove it real quick I usually don't show how I remove the bolts but hey why not something different then you're gonna come in here to this side this hose right here you're just gonna pull it out I kind of already did it a little bit but just to show you just do that right take it off and then if you come and look in here on the side and inside here you're gonna have to remove this um, bracket clipper it's already kind of loose you kind of just loosen that up just enough so you can pull this out all right guys so we're gonna loosen that up and there we go this cover came out of the air intake so now let me show you what to do next hey guys so moving forward we're gonna disconnect the battery uh just unplug the positive side um just unplug it put it on the side and then we can move forward to removing the alternator i'm using a size 8 but you may have an 8 10 or a 12 all right guys, so now what we're gonna do is gonna remove these two cables, the plugs. So this is very easy. Um, just come for this one, just come back here and there's a little button like you can see right here, just press it as you can see and then just pull back. It's very easy to just, just press and pull back. Just press and pull, put it on the side, very easy. Now this cover, just pull this cover back. Uh, just press the button, the little thing and you pull it back. And now you have a size 10 nut right there, uh, which you just remove that and you can put all the cables on the side. My setup is very easy. It's just a you know, size 10 socket extension. Very easy. Just remove this and put everything on the side. All right, guys. So now that you remove the electrical cable, just put them to the side and that takes care of that. Now we have two bolts. They're size 12. Remember that. Uh, this mechanism right here so you can remove the belt. Um, but we're gonna remove the alternator and remove the whole thing off. So we're gonna take off this bolt and they'll take care of all that. So just loosen up the long bolt and we can be able to move the alternator to the side. So just loosen up the big bolt right here, just loosen this one out uh, and then we're gonna take this one off um, totally. And then once we do that, we'll be able to, to move the alternator all the way to the front. That will automatically, we can take off the belt and also the alternator. But there's one more bolt on the alternator. I'm gonna show you the location of that, but just take this one out after you loosen up the first one. And you can take this one all the way out and then with that it's a size 12 with that you'll be able to move the alternator uh, all the way to the front like that to the side follow that rail and then um, that will remove the belt and then like i mentioned there's another bolt it's in the back i'm going to show you that in just a minute but just take care of this first and then we'll do the rest now all right guys so i removed that as you can see this whole thing comes over once it does you can just push it over as i mentioned before and now the belt is off so that's one step belt is off very easy now keep it that way pushed all the way over there's a bolt right here on the back and if you come through here i'm going to be able to show it to you uh let's see let me focus um it's this one right here yep this one right there it's a size 14 um you can actually it's hard to get to get the camera to see it but you can actually see it really easy it's a size 14 you remove that and the alternator will come out very easy job um i'm gonna do that i'm gonna come back here i'm gonna do that this this bracket here may bother you but as you can see you can move it up or down so you move it up and the alternator is going to come right out very easy job it was really quick that way you can check your alternator replace it or whatever um if it if it helped guys please subscribe give us a like thanks for watching and i'm sure this video will help a lot of people Okay guys, I removed the bolt, quick little clip before I go. Remove the bolt, it's gonna stay there. It's a little bit loose like this, but it's kind of stuck. So you're gonna have to wiggle and bring up, wiggle and bring up. Mine was easy. Usually I done other alternators and they're kind of harder, but um, you just wiggle, wiggle and pull, wiggle and pull, wiggle and pull, and that's it. This is your alternator. That's it guys, that's how you remove it. Please like and subscribe, thanks.